Hi there, let's try to understand how to customize the start menu and taskbar and get a great experience. Okay, that being said, let's jump into this short lecture. Launching applications is much more efficient when you customize them uh, in the taskbar or in the start menu uh, to show the application that you use most often. So let's see how to get that set. Um, I want you to start by going into the start menu uh, as a first and then how to you know, customize this I would like to explain later point we'll go into the uh, taskbar so that being said for the first thing if you have your multiple application in the start you could actually scroll up and down with your scroll button or you could click here to scroll up and down to see what are the applications got pinned in so pinned applications is a quick handy to you know uh, it will be there on uh, frequently used applications you can you know pin it so that you no need to go to entire app list to scroll and open up some kind of you know weather instead uh, you could actually pin it so when you click on pin uh, here pin to start this is gonna uh, come up on the start button you see here it will be in this pin but if you see here i have two pages or the two scrolls and this is coming in the last if i want this should be no top i can simply drag and i can place it wherever i want like you know the first page first icon second icon i can drag and drop and also the unnecessary applications you can always unpin them for example i don't want a facebook so i can either unpin or if i don't want i can actually for example spotify i don't want to use it so i can uninstall them from here so when i do uninstall it actually goes even from my screen and i can make more attractive or more productive for with the start button so if i want any other application to be pinned i can simply go there and simply right click and click on start to pin for example microsoft teams and come back here and see here pinning here these things i don't want so i can simply unpin them mail for example i, I need tips i don't need it uh, so i can unpin movies i can unpin and a couple of other applications also i can unpin them for example oh, in this case the photos i don't want and the office i don't want or games like these things can be unpinned this way uh it will be more clean and uh it's easy to you know work with your start button you can also pin the required things to your taskbar for example i can pin to taskbar so that the mail application will be available here and in any case if i don't want this application i can always right click here to unpin from taskbar so that it goes but it doesn't uninstall it will stay on my app applications list here you see here the mail application will be there it just disappear from here and if you see there are a few things like you know widgets and also the um, teams kind of you know applications are fully customized and these are uh, comes by default if you would like to you know customize further you can always right click and simply unpin them and if you want more further customization you can always click on taskbar settings and go to personalization and you have your taskbar so this is where you could do the customization for example i don't want this microsoft chat which comes as a built-in you can toggle this button to offside so that it will go off and similarly if you don't want search you can click on this and the task views will help you out quickly to you know jump into different desktops if you would like to so within the same desktop you have multiple desktops you can have these are the virtual kind of you know, desktops you can segregate these uh, desktops and you can take the advantage of that if you want you know you can take it out and if you look at here these are the widgets uh, that you want to you know or whether you want to you know keep them or you want to you know take it out it is possible with this uh, widgets so when you take out all the widgets will go off from here so this is how you could actually customize your taskbar in case if you want to go back always you can go back 
to the personalization and last but not least so if you see taskbar uh, you want you know uh, start button to be corner of the left side you could achieve that by going here instead of the taskbar alignment you, instead of the center you can put it to the left side but unfortunately you can't put it to the right so that's not possible so you could choose the options that you wanted and also taskbar can be automatically hide in case if you want to choose this button it automatically hides that and whenever cursor goes here it automatically comes back this uh, taskbar and these are the things um, that we can talk about the personalization with respect to the personalization settings for start button as well as the taskbar. I hope this short lecture is useful for you. Thank you.